This is how good drivers turn bad. It's DK and I'm back with another video. Make sure you put me on your big screen video. If you are not subscribed, do me a favor and smash the subscribe button. Also, give me a thumbs up. Why would you do that? You are going to do that because we will be giving away over $1,000 when we get to 100,000 subscribers. In order to win, you must be subscribed. So make sure you hit that subscribe button. Now, it's time for us to go out here and get busy. I'm glad you guys are with me. We got order number uno. We're trying to get our pockets fat like sumo. We are picking up an order from Home Depot. We're about to use an app called Roadie, Roadie, Roadie with a Devil Ranch. We're about to use a Roadie app. We are picking up 24 items, driving four miles for 45 48 I'm about to pull up and get this cake let's go and we are here at home depot baby my favorite store we're here to go get a pop of a crisco all right what's the order number? um wj 540602237 what's going on you ready to get an order <laughs> what's going on see you again. i'm doing great i can't complain how you doing good i just saw your video like literally right now <laughs> yes yeah, awesome i appreciate the uh support so i was gonna tell you on the last video you had the like was it most? It was like 20, 20 and twenty. Yeah. You you can't ask the Home Depot to give you the the whole pallet in your van. Yeah. See, they usually do that, but there was a whole bunch of people in there, and I usually go to the back of the store, but right. they had me. They was already had it on the side. Oh, okay. And there were there was nobody there with a fork truck, so that's the uh, reason why I had to do that, man. Yeah. It was critical. So I'm like, that's a lot of work. <laughs> it was, it was right. critical. Gotta put a little work in, huh? Yeah. <laughs> Y'all know what time it is, baby. It's people everywhere. It's people going around here. We're trying to get in and get out of the bank robbery. Hey, I don't want these bags to bust. This, this is cow manure right here. If that joint busts in the van, oh, this joint gonna be stank. Dang it, boy. Gotta be careful with these. Uh, and just like that, we gone. It's time for us to pull up and get in our zone. Let's go. And we are here at the drop off trying to knock their socks off. Let's see if the customer here, it says something about putting it in front of the garage. Um, but it's the car right there, so I don't know. Guess what? I ain't trying to do all that work anyway. I ain't gonna lie. I ain't gonna lie. Flocker. If not, we put it on the driveway, baby. We ain't playing no game about to do our thing. Hello. I'm here with your Home Depot order. Oh, how come you didn't call? It didn't tell me to call. <coughs> Where did, where's your car? Inside? It's on the side right here. And the driveway? Yeah. Okay, I'll open the bus and end the garage. There's a car right there. Can you move it for me? Uh, there's a car, so I, I can't back all the way up. Just back in the car, and then it's a short distance to bring it in. Okay. Because I cannot move it. Oh, you can't move it? No. Okay. All right, thank you. Um, I can put it. I can put it right here. I can put it in the front, wherever you would like me to put it at. I will not be able to lift it up, darling. No, I can't. That's why I I said somebody move it out so you can have a move this car. Uh huh. They move the car so you would space here. Yeah, but it, it's a lot of weight right here. It's a lot huh? of stuff. It's a lot of stuff I'm gonna have to carry. I can't do it. I can't put it in the garage. Only. Uh, outside of the garage. I could put it like right here on the side or in the front. And then I could have just picked it up myself without paying somebody. That's the reason why I had okay. it delivered. Okay, I understand. If you want me to, I can take it back to the store. Huh? If you want, I can take it back to the store. And then? And then they ha I guess they maybe have someone else deliver it or you can pick it up, whichever one you want to do. If I move the car right here, Will you be I able? need. Can you put it? If you you can you move it in the garage? I just want to get it to closest to, close to as possible because it's a far walk for me to bring all the bags right here. I have bed. I am almost blind. Oh. Okay. Yeah. So what did you say? Um, if you move the car like in the garage, I can put it right here. I just need to get it close. I need to get it close so I don't have to walk so far. Can you drive it here? So. I don't want to ruin it. No, no, no. I could drive it in here if you want me to. You have the keys? Yeah. Old school bins. Sheesh. She close in this job. Man, 
last one. Step back in with the photo, y'all. Smack. We go. All right, thank you. You have a great one. Order two and three. It's time for us to get some more cheese. We are going to get another Home Depot. We're using an app called Rody 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 with a Deborah Wrench. Again, we have to go ahead and get these dividends. We are picking up two orders. The first order is a refrigerator. We're going to drive two miles for $21.35. And a second order is a shelf. We're going to drive seven miles and receive a payment of $47. 38. I love being great. Let's go. Good morning. I'm gonna have two Brody orders to pick up. Brody, yes, sir. Can I get the first order number? Um, WG 609205. Okay, boom. And then the other one? Uh, second one is H 1987 20 77 41. <clears throat> Y'all see it, baby. Look, we got this refrigerator, and this is actually an SUV or a hatchback order. I'm gonna reach out to, uh, Rolling and see if they can give us some more money because guess what? I don't see this fitting in a hatchback or um an SUV. So we're gonna do what we gotta do so we can get this cheese so we can get this cheese. Slide. You wanna slide? Then slide then. Pop out. Uh, slide this thing here. And just like that, we gone. It's time for us to pull up to two people's homes. Let's go. Just like that, we are here to drop off location. They ain't got no room up here, baby. So guess what we gonna do? We gonna put it on the second stair. They got some stairs right here, so we gonna uh, roll this joint up on a dolly right here. Then we gonna -da, swing it around. Put it right there. Step back with the photo. Y'all already know. Smack. We gone. Now, I did try to receive some more money for the fridge, but unfortunately, they said absolutely not. They said if the order does not fit in your uh, your vehicle, then just take it back to the store or cancel it. Um, but they would not give me any more money. And I don't know, I think they're kind of wrong for that because from what I know, I'm not sure if it's 100%, comment below and let me know if you know, refrigerators are supposed to be stood up. But this one was for a, um, a hatchback or SUV. So in a hatchback or SUV, it, it, it wouldn't be able to stand up. So I don't know what they're talking about, but it is what it is. I ain't complaining, I'm maintaining. I'm about to go ahead and get this change and whip this grain. I'm doing great, yourself? Right. I'm here with your uh, Home Depot order. Oh, perfect. All right, sorry, we've got like three different things coming. Oh, in okay. I was like, all right, which one's this one? <laughs> I didn't mean to scare you. I know no, no, people no, no, pulling no, no, in no, your no, driveway no. and stuff. So where would you like to sit it at? Uh, if you uh, if you don't mind, like right there would be absolutely perfect. Right there? Yeah, because okay. I'm going to set it up and move it. Okay. It, it weighs a little bit. It's yeah. not light. Okay, tell me where to stop. Uh, let's do it right here. Alrighty. Perfect. Thank you very much. Thank I appreciate you. your help. I just have to take a photo and I'm good yeah, to go. Sure. Hit him with the photo. Got that. I'm good to go. Thank you very much. So you have a So this is how a good driver turns bad. This is what happens. As you guys saw that first order was absolutely critical. I was trying to be nice to the old lady. Hey, I ain't gonna lie. I'm gonna be I'm gonna keep it G real with y'all, cuz look. The lady took me up top. She definitely took me up top, had me doing all that extracurricular stuff. Oh darling, come here, darling. Do me a favor. If the open boxes we move here, open box, and then we put the old, the new one. And she did not give me a tip. That's the reason why I feel that some good drivers turn bad because they just stop caring. Now you could care so much as try to help people out as much as you can, whether they older, younger, or anything like that. You can try to help them out as much as they can. They're not gonna tip you. They don't even care. They're not gonna, they're not gonna care. So you get to a point where you just stop caring. I want to tell you guys this. If you can continue to try to do great things because you're gonna be paid back for, for good karma. You're gonna be paid back for that. I understand that you might be upset about them not tipping you or they doing this or they doing that they want you to do all this and they do all that i understand i i absolutely understand if you don't if nobody understand i understand but at the end of the day all your blessings is not going to come from the same people so just because you did something for one person does not mean the blessing is going to come from that person it may come from somewhere else so make sure you guys keep that in mind but i do want to say this that is the reason why i kind of no longer really knock on doors and stuff. The only reason why I knocked on her door was because I really didn't know where to put that stuff at. It, the way that everything was shaped and everything, I really didn't know where to put it at. So um, I actually knocked on the door and she wanted me to put the stuff in the garage. I actually did, I didn't want to do it. I'm gonna tell you, I, I did not want to do it, but I was kind of feeling bad. I was feeling like 
if this is my grandma or mom or someone, I want somebody to help her, help them. So that's the reason why I did it. But comment below and let me know what your thoughts about this is. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Again, if you're not subscribed, you might want to smash the subscribe button. I told you guys earlier in the video, we are giving away over $1,000 when we get to 100,000 subscribers. In order to earn your chance to win, you must be subscribed. We only got like 14,000 more to go. And we're going to go out there and scope. Well, y'all going to go out there and scope because y'all going to get that dough. But I will see you guys on the next one. Be cool, be cool, be fooling. You already know in the DDK, and I'm on my way.